me am God. Me control General Ealing. Me use him as puppet. Me make costume. Me am good at making costumes. Me fabricate mask. Me seamstress for suit for Clancy Brown to wear me not actually talk me just use brain to tell people through mind reading me control them me make them think of me's bad time during surgery me sees wells as papa he let me ride bicycle he give me ice cream and no banana split me hate banana split me go on quality time with him he my papa i do his bidding he tell me he wants me to distract Team Flash while he does his own thing talking to his ancestor I go corrupt the Flash's mind He thinks of good thoughts, like how he is in love with Iris, something that I'm sure me and all the viewers don't give two shits about. I was supposed to to be the main villain of this episode and even though they kept talking about me you barely saw me in the episode and so when I actually was about to fight him I got immediately hit by a train I got hit by a train like Sandman in Spider-Man 3, but I'm still alive, I'm still wandering amongst the city, climbing on buildings and jumping off of them, and for some reason the Flash does not see me, even though this happened right behind him. I guess he's putting it off till 
next season when he gives a shit about everything I'm doing, but he doesn't at the moment. Instead, he cares about Iris, who I don't give a shit about. I know that the reason why I did not get enough screen time is because I'm very expensive. I am made from CGI, and that would mean a lot of budget to make me and have me consistently villain throughout episode. But it's my episode. It's me episode. Doesn't mean I doesn't that mean I get a lot of screen time? Apparently not. Still have to be minimal appearances because my appearances go way off budget. I need to go join forces with all of the TV villains who require were too much CGI. Like Absorbing Man and Doomsday. We CGI characters together strong. They live action characters weak. <laughs> <laughs>